the top 5 cycles from Mantra. Hey guys and welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys 5 cycles from Mantra. This is their 2022 range and well they only released 5 cycles so far so this is a review of all 5 cycles. So it's not really a top 5 list. We have 2 hybrids, 2 MTBs and 1 urban sport. So now let's head into the list with the hybrids. We have the Montra Trans. The traction on this bike is at 24 speed. The 8 speed freewheel at the back has a Shimano Turny derailleur. The 3 Pro wheel cranks in the front also has a Shimano Turny derailleur. There's no front suspension, so it's a full rigid hybrid. The 620mm handlebar is mounted on a 70mm stem. Brakes and gear shifters are in an integrated unit. The 35C tires are mounted on double wall alloy rims. Braking is provided by mechanical disc brakes. Metal pedals are standard as the single accessory mounting point. This bike weighs around about 14 and a half kgs. With a price of 24,900 rupees, this is the Montra Trans. Next we have the Montra Downtown. The traction of this bike is at 21 speed. The 7 speed freewheel at the back has a Shimano Turny derailleur. The 3 cranks in the front also has a Shimano Turny derailleur. This bike does not have any suspension in the front, it's a full rigid hybrid. The 620mm handlebar is mounted on a 70mm step. The brakes and gear shifters are an integrated unit. The 35C tires are mounted on double wall alloy rims. Braking is brought by mechanical disc brakes. The plastic pedals are standard as the single accessory mounting point. This bike weighs in about 14 and a half kgs. With a price of 22,800, this is the Montra Downtown. Well guys, the next category is Urban Sport. It's a nice different category, it's a combination of a hybrid and an MTB, quite nice. Before we go in, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Next we have the Montra Cord. The traction of this bike is at 21 speed. The 7 speed freewheel at the back has a Shimano Turny derailleur. The three cranks in the front also has a Shimano Turny derailleur. This bike does not have a suspension in the front. It's a full rigid urban sport cycle. The 620mm handlebar is mounted on a 75mm stem. Brakes and gear shifters are an integrated unit. 
The 27.5 inch tires are mounted on double wall alloy rims. Braking is provided by mechanical disc brakes. Plastic pedals are standard as a single axis remounting point. This bike weighs in at about 15 kgs. The Montra Quad is priced at 25,200 rupees. Now the last two are going to be MTBs, the Backbeat and the Mad Rock. Next we have the Montra Backbeat. The direction of this bike is at 21 speed. The 7 speed freewheel at the back has a Shimano turning derailleur. The three cranks in the front also has a Shimano Turney derailleur. On the front, you have an 80mm zoom suspension. This comes with a lockout and load adjuster. The 680mm handlebar is mounted on an 80mm stem. Brakes and gear shifters are an integrated unit. The 27.5 inch tires are mounted on double wall alloy rims. Braking is provided by mechanical disc brakes. Plastic pedals are standard as a single axis remounting point. This bike weighs in at about 15 kgs. The Montra Packbeat 27.5 is available at 26,250 rupees. There's another version of this bike, it's a 29er, and that is available at 27,000 rupees. Next, we have the Montra Mad Rock. The direction of this bike is at 21 speed. The 7 speed freewheel at the back has a Shimano Turney derailleur. The 3 cranks in the front also has a Shimano Turney derailleur. The 680mm handlebar is mounted on an 80mm stem. Brakes and gear shifters are an integrated unit. On the front, we have a 50mm zoom suspension. This does not have a lockout or a load adjuster. The 27.5 inch tires are mounted on double wall alloy rims. Braking is provided by mechanical disc brakes. Plastic pedals are standard as the single axis remounting point. This bike weighs in at about 15 kgs. The Montra Mad Rock 27.5 is priced at 23400 and the Montra Mad Rock 29er is priced at 24,150 rupees. So guys, this was 5 Montra cycles. My personal favorite was the Urban Sport, the Cord. It looks really nice and well, it feels more like an MTB while having a lot of hybrid characteristics. Which is your favorite in this list? Do comment below and let me know. That's it for now. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Do share with your friends. And until next time, safe ride everyone.